literally live right here. Just, just finished watching Roman and Cody. And it's not even the shock and awe of everything that happened. Because, spoiler alert, this is going to be a completely separate video from the recap because I got to make my jokes over there because I can't do it right now. There were moments when you remember why you love a thing. Watching that story get finished is the reason I love this shit. I can't stunt, I can't lie. This is real. And they sit up here and say, it's real to me, damn it, and you can mean that all day long if you want to. I can't help what all of the emotions of seeing everything that happened the spectacle that was that wrestling match. Everything that I have ever loved about this thing that I love was encapsulated in a single match that damn near didn't happen. Think about that. If the quote unquote Cody Crop Babies didn't revolt, if Triple H wasn't the man he was and the rock for calling the plate right on the field and audibly to make sure that the proper story gets told. I probably would be skipping straight to those jokes that I've literally written down in my notes. But there is no way that I could go from this emotional moment of watching Cody Rhodes do the thing and then sit up here and talk about everything else that's WrestleMania. I can't. I don't want to. Those two things need to be separate because, again, the last time I sat down and had one of these moments was the Thank You Taker video forever ago. And I remember making that and understanding and knowing the historical significance of what that was. When they say that this is the Triple H here, boy, they mean it. Because I'm like, if this is what we're in for when it comes to the thing we absorb that is the WWE, I am completely down for whatever it is. Flat out. I'm like, y'all ain't know this because of the quality of this camera. I'm still feeling the emotion coming out of my eyes. Right I think I have to say this. I don't think I have been prouder to be a fan of this thing we love than right now. And and again, like I said, it's not the spectacle that that match was because my jaw hit the floor multiple times. We will talk about that. But it's the fact of the matter that regardless of how you tell the story, if the story makes you feel, if it makes you act, if it makes you react, if it gets anything out of you, then the story has done its job. And you can't ask for more than that. I think the lesson we're supposed to take away from this is things have to change and things have to evolve and you have to give them that room to grow. And as I've learned recently, and we're going to talk about that in a whole separate video, sometimes you're not strong enough to get out of your own way. And sometimes nature has to take its course and do what it needs to do to get it to where it needs to be. And Cody finishing the story is nature taking its proper course. I am excited 
and invigorated about this in a way that I don't think I have been in a very long time in hell if at all. And it's all because one man looked at his situation and was like, nah, bro, this ain't working for me. If you're not going to give it to me, I'm going to take it myself. And damn did he take it. And hell, damn did he earn what it was he walked out there and took. That's all you can really ask. I think I've said my piece, but I needed to get this out because I need to get to doing what I do, what I do, and riffing on this premium live event. But I had to have this moment to give whatever this is and get it out and get it out there for people to see because I ain't going to be embarrassed about feeling the way that I do given what it was that I just witnessed. I'm like, nah, we, at this juncture, I'm so deep in this hall, it's amazing to be embarrassed about it that I never was in the first place. But you understand what I'm saying. For all pro wrestling fans around the world, we eating good right now. You've always been eating. You've always been eating good. But we eating great right now. And it's only going to get better from here. So, um, I'm going to deal with the rest of my post-WrestleMania 40 emotion, and we're going to come back, and we're actually going to talk about night two, and we're going to see how much did I hit, because I'm trying to see if I hit the jackpot on the cash money, and we got a whole lot to discuss, including the whole match that made this video possible. So, I will step away. We're going to come back right after these commercial messages and we're going to do the damn thing. WrestleMania Night 2, the results show, right after these commercials.